Welcome to Grace for All, a devotional podcast produced by First United Methodist Church, Maryville, Tennessee. I will show you. The Lord had said to Abram, Go from your country, your people, and your father's household to the land I will show you. Genesis chapter 12, verse 1, New International Version. Ain't it the truth? God says, Go to the place I will show you. How many times in life have I started out thinking I had a clear sense of direction only to find the place I arrived was not at all the place I had envisioned? Can you relate? Often, the journey has been long and hard, filled with unexpected twists and obstacles. Often, I have found myself asking whether I could possibly be on the right path, and I have been tempted to give up or turn back. But more times than not, the place God showed me, while different than I imagined, filled me with awe and gratitude. Mostly, I have been surprised by how the real beauty and blessing was in the journey itself. Such is life in faith. Usually, when God calls us, the only things that are certain are the things we leave behind. The destination is a mystery revealed only when we have arrived, and we can finally say, Oh, now I see. This is where you were leading me all along. It strikes me that God's promise to Abram was not in the land so much as in the showing. I will show you, God says. I will. It is God's faithfulness to Abram and not Abram's faithfulness to God that results in the fulfillment of the promise. God's faithfulness still results in fulfillment of God's promises. Even now, God is calling us with these same words, Go to the place I will show you. Faithful God, increase our faith in you that we would not hesitate to go, knowing you will show us the way. Amen. Thank you for joining us for today's podcast. I'm Jonathan Jonas, Senior Pastor of First United Methodist Church. Our church is a vital, vibrant congregation sharing the love and grace of Jesus Christ in Maryville, Tennessee, and now wherever podcasts are available. This podcast is written and produced by the members of our congregation. To know more about this ministry or any of our church's ministries, please visit our website at firstchurch.org. That's the number one, S-T-C-H-U-R-C-H dot O-R-G. Join us again for the next episode, and until then, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God our Father, and the communion of God's Holy Spirit be with you now and always. Amen.